With 125,000 doses secured, health officials have announced phase one of Mexico's national vaccination program. They say despite initial shortages of the vaccine, everyone in the country can expect equal access as supplies permit. Everyone will have access to the vaccine, everyone. But vaccines do not arrive in a single blow. They cannot be given at the same time to all. Some will be prioritized over others, such as the most vulnerable and health workers who are at the front lines. The announcement that COVID-19 vaccinations will begin at the end of December comes at a critical time for Mexico. In the capital, at least seven hospitals are operating at full capacity and more than a dozen others nearing their limits, according to international health observers. Today, the city is in a critical situation due to this increase in hospitalizations. And that is why we call on the population to stay at home and go out only if they have to. Ahead of Mexico's busy holiday season, authorities have issued guidelines asking people to avoid large gatherings, gift exchanges, and to postpone their travel plans on Christmas and the New Year, although there is resistance. We have to activate the economy. I know that there is a lot of fear, but really people also need production. They need to sell, they need to produce. We can't just stay home waiting with our arms crossed. Even traffic appears to be nearing pre-pandemic levels. As hospitals in the Mexican capital continue to fill up, so do streets and department stores. Health policy experts warn people should not be lured into a false sense of security just because a vaccine is on the way. Though limitations on social gatherings are recommended, state and federal authorities have stopped short of enforcing any major restrictions. Many here expect the announcement of a partial lockdown could be inevitable before the end of the year. Manuel Rapalo, Al Jazeera, Mexico City.